Welcome to How to Repair Your Own Legend Now. We appreciate your coming here and getting information from us. And we've just got a little bit of some bookkeeping kinds of things here to go over with you as we start. We're going to cover the four areas of this that, that we feel are really important. We call that assess, correct, make over, and monitor. So we're going to cover those things. We would like you there on the webinar, you can type in questions to us. You can see that right there on your screen right now. Uh, we can't get to all these questions right here. We know that. I'll be monitoring over here as Dr. Mark is doing some other things over there. I'll be monitoring what these questions are and I'll jot down some of these questions and we'll answer some in those four areas. And every time we finish an area, we'll answer a couple questions, maybe one or two questions and then right. we'll move on. But rest assured, I mean, feel free to put in uh, your questions down because we will yes. answer all of your questions. It's just that the ones we can't get to during the webinar itself, we're going to send you back by email. Right, we'll email you. And if you send us a really awesome question, we may actually create a whole podcast about it uh, separately afterwards because we love to answer questions. Okay, we have to move, uh, move along here. So. Yes, we do. So with Monitor, what we want to make sure here is that nobody can come and do anything to us again. So part of the problem that things have built up or there's negative things that are out there is because we just haven't been watching, we haven't been observing, we haven't seen what's gone on. So we want to make sure that there's a monitoring system in place. So what have we done? We've assessed. We've already taken a look to see what's right. out there, right? Then we went on and we did corrective movements to get rid of the stuff oh, by pushing it yeah. down, right? We've done the makeover, which again is our largest area. Where you're going to spend the most time there because you're going to continue to create things all the time because you want to be current. You want your most... I went to a site where I really liked this guy and I was telling you about this guy that I thought was doing some great information and so I downloaded his PDF and I was so excited about it and I went to read it and he's talking about 43 million people on, uh, on Facebook. Right. And a little, I thought, little old now that we're over this, 500 million. Right? Hasn't this guy updated this stuff in years? And he's a he's got lots of things. That did he's did done. we mention before that the internet is forever? It is uh, forever. There are things that are there that are no longer exactly. alive and running, but exactly. they're still there. So we want to go to monitor, and the first thing we're going to tell people to do, of course, is to set up Google Alerts. Right. I mean, Google is uh, is your friend in many ways, even if it's indexing the things that got you into trouble in the first place. But it is your friend if you play by its rules, which is. Uh, but they have all these great tools, and Google yes. Alerts are so easy. Just go to Google uh, into your, your Google account, and you uh, if you go to Google, there's a little thing to the right that says more, and if it's not right in there, there's a little drop down that says even more, and you get the full panel of all the, all the free little wonderful tools that Google has, and one of them is Google Alerts. And really, all you're doing is entering keywords, and uh, you're choosing an interval, so you can, ha you can have uh, Google send you an email every single day if you want around a, a keyword or you can set it for once a week or you can set it for one Hi, this is Charlie Seymour Jr. And this is Dr. Mark Osmond. And when you search your name online, what do you find? That's right, you, we always recommend that you go to Google, go to the search engine, Search yourself, your keywords, do an assessment, look at what you find. Is that an accurate reflection of who you are and how you want to appear to people when they look for you? That's right, because we have Create Your Own Legend now, and we're helping people really build up that legend about themselves online, so that when people search for them, they really see the side of them that they want, and it's three to ten pages deep of information about you that you control. But Charlie, but what happens when you do that assessment? You're in those first three pages and you find either it's not a good reflection of you or someone has posted negative reviews about you or negative information or inaccurate information. What right. are you supposed to do? People exactly. keep asking us that. People keep coming to us about that. So we're going to cover that in this webinar. I'm really thrilled with the outline that we've come up with for this webinar. So on Tuesday, we want you to join us on this webinar. See what it is to create that legend about yourself. Grow that personal side of you that other people can see. But when there's a problem, you need to be able to take care of that. And that's what we're going to be able to help you with on this webinar. That's right. So just click the link here. Go to the registration page. We're going to give you our four-part system for how you're going to repair going to your own to you. legend. And you can choose on the registration form what time on Tuesday is going to work best for you. We're going to do this a couple of times on Tuesday. Right. So click that link, 
go sign up for this webinar and learn how to create your own legend, and if there's a problem, how to repair your own legend now. Join us on the webinar.